So that's passed. Thank you. So now we're up to item 15, which is a Litchfield Street. No stopping restriction. So, Mike. Happy to move? Uh, I've, I've got a question. And uh, Sarah's happy to move and Mark's happy to second it. I'm just trying to find out where the hell it is. I'm just trying to, oh, if you could put the plan up on the on the screen, please, save so me having to run around looking for it. Uh-huh, yep, thank you. Um, I, tot I totally agree of why we're doing this, because we've got a bit longer tram than we used to have. Um, just a question, could we, on that plan where it says no stopping restrictions, the existing no stopping restrictions to remain, could we actually fill that up with cars? Could we make that parking? Because I understand because the backside of the tram hangs out and that's what caused the problem, I can certainly understand why we're proposing the no stopping there, but could we then fill in a little bit behind it? Possibly. Thank you for the There's question. There's going to be a good, there'll be, there'll be a good answer coming, I'm sure. Uh, yeah, I have. Yes, uh, well, obviously it's existing, and uh, looking at removing it, there were two issues that looked at this in coordination with another proposal that's uh, being looked at for Litchfield Street at the moment, but... There's two issues. One is, firstly, you'll notice there's a grey path heading north-south, uh, which runs parallel to Huanui Lane. Uh, that no stopping was there just to give people who use that uh, walking path some visibility if they wish to cross uh, Litchfield Street. Mm -hmm. uh, the second is in line with proposals being looked at currently for this road, uh, that was proposed to be a, a curb extension area to further assist pedestrians crossing Litchfield Street uh, in, view, in terms of uh, road crossing distance and site visibility of approaching vehicles. So that was the reasoning I left the existing no stopping in that position and just extended along uh, to ensure that um, there was plenty of room. Uh, just another another thing that I've suddenly remembered is that the problem there is not just with the tail swing of the larger tram that has been purchased since the tram track was put in there. Uh, it's they've also it's not only the problem with that tail swing, but it's also been an issue where if cars are large vehicles are parked poorly, i.e. out from the curb, there have been times when the tram driver has actually had to stop the tram and wait and attempt to find the owner of the vehicle. Sometimes I've heard that it's the fortune they haven't been too far away um, to, to get across the road. So putting back parking as well would just uh, further extend a, an existing problem that we have with the tram track so close to the parked vehicles. Mm -hmm. I, I just look at um, uh, all of those uh, residential buildings there which have probably got not a lot of off-street parking and, and we're, we're, we're just removing some, which I, because we could almost end up, the, the ones you're going to take away, which is fine, and I certainly understand why you're doing it, um, whereas we could sort of make it not so bad and put some back, but that's right. I'm, I'm just asking the question, that's right. Okay. Sorry, Phil, can I just point out that that's um, all of the parking down Litchfield Street is currently under consideration, and we're looking at the number of people there and all those kind of things as part of the Takaha Streets hearings panel. So we're currently looking at exactly that stretch of road. Okay. Yeah. Righto, thank you. So you had we had the mover and the seconder. I'll put them up. Oh, sorry, Aaron, did you have a question? <laughs> just, just a quick question. Uh, it was a follow-up to yours about the reinstating kind of the two behind. But is that a cut down coming out of Rakura Park? See, with the grey path where it hits the curb line, is that a cut down in the curb line? Oh, it is? It is a cut down, yeah. Okay, no, fair okay. enough. So that kind of clears, clears that yeah, up. Yeah, no, no, fair enough. Yeah. No, thank no, you for that. That's all right. Okay, so I'll put that motion. All those in favour? Aye. Against? Thank you, carried. Great. So we're, I can't believe it. We're actually ahead of time. 
Um, we need to be back here at two o'clock on the dot.